Good evening and welcome to Worldwide News, where we discuss the important stuff. Firstly tonight, a former Russian secret agent critically injured after claims he was prisoned. An ex-Russian spy under police guard in hospital after claims his government tried to kill him in a London restaurant. It's thought Alexander Vafosky was prisoned with a chemical called lethalium. He'd met a contact to try and expose who murdered a reporter who'd heavily criticised the Russian president, Vladimir. Godfather's his friend. Secondly tonight, Tony Blair's thanked British troops in Afghanistan for the courage they've shown fighting the Taliban. He spent an hour with, an, an hour and a half rather, talking to soldiers at the main British camp in Helmand province. The government's putting more money into pupil mentoring scheme in schools to try to stop bullying. It comes as new reports says 20,000 children are skipping classes every day due to bullying. Next on news, mountain rescue teams are searching for two high climbers who climbed ice mountains who have gone missing in the Kalbons. It's thought they may have been caught in an avalanche. Michael Mudford from Ralph Kimros reports. Thank you, Michael. Next on the news, Blackburn and Spurs both ended up with 10 men in one all draw at Ewood Park. Red cards for two guy and Hossam Gali and Martin, Do Martin Joel got to an argument with the ref. And more problems for Hearts and the SPL after a one to nil defeat at home to Rangers. There was a fans protest calling for Captain Stephen Pressey to be recalled and owner Vladimir Romanov to go. You heard it first on Worldwide News. I'm Amanda Hug and Kiss. Good night.